Hi, this is Ilse from Australia. Today I'm going to show beginner zither players how to play an accompaniment to a folk song with just two chords. The zither with its many strings can be daunting to look at for a novice as it has nearly as many notes as the piano. To master it takes indeed some time, but as it originated as a folk instrument, it's also possible to create pleasant music by playing just simple chord accompaniment to folk tunes. Here's an Austrian folk song from my album 39 Great Zither Tune. It's called and I now go to Peter's Flowing Spring. Now I'm going to show you how to play chords on the open strings. The first 12 strings are the accompaniment strings. The next 12 strings are bass strings. The very fat strings at the end are contra bass strings. Probably not for the beginner. Your eye always homes in to the red string, which is close to the sound hole. This is string number 15. Put finger four on the red F string near the sound hole. This is your bass note. Now put finger three on the red A string, that's string number seven. Now put finger two on the red F, F, F string, which is string number three. And add string number four when you actually plug it that way. <laughs> Now try an umpapa pattern. Try and do this without looking. This hand shape or claw shape as my son jokingly calls it is for a major chord. You can take this shape and move it away from you one string and you will have formed the C chord. Move your hand away one more string and you have the G chord. In my 
demonstration of Peter's flowing spring. I'm only using C and G chord, but on the backing track CD, I actually play the melody and the accompaniment strings. You can also play chords on the fretboard. Um, playing chords on the fretboard is much louder than the regular chords from the accompaniment string. This is what I played on the video. I will now show you C and G7. Here is the chart for the two chords I just played on the fretboard. The sum is finger one and stays on the outer A string on fret 10, which is G. The other fingers move. There are more chord charts in my teaching book. Let's start the concert sit up. 